Plus E.V. Ferguson, 1896. The Supreme Court case that upheld the Louisiana segregation law on the theory that as long as the accommodations between the racially segregated facilities were equal, the Equal Protection Clause was not violated, the court's ruling effectively established the constitutionality of racial segregation and the notion of separate but equal. Truman banned racial segregation from armed forces, 1948. Executive Order 9981 is an executive order issued on July 26, 1948 by President Harry S. Truman. It abolished racial discrimination in the United States Armed Forces and eventually led to the end of segregation in the services. Sweet V. Painter, Brown v. Board of Education, Topeka, Kansas, 1954 Supreme Court ruling reversing the policy of segregation from Plessy v. Ferguson, declaring that separate can never be equal and a year later ordered the integration of all public schools with all deliberate speed. Montgomery Bus Boycott, 1955 In 1955, after Rosa Parks was arrested for refusing to give up her seat on a city bus, Dr. Martinell King led a boycott of city buses. After 11 months, the Supreme Court ruled that segregation of public transportation was illegal. U.S. troops sent to protect the little nine black school children who decided to attend a previously all-white high school in Little Rock, Arkansas, because riots were expected and occurring, Eisenhower sent federal protection for these little nine. They remained in the school for the entirety of the school year. Civil Rights Act of 1957 Primarily a voting rights bill was the first civil rights legislation passed by Congress in the United States since Reconstruction following the American Civil War, the Civil Rights Act of 1957 was also Congress's show of support for the Supreme Court. Greensboro sit-ins, 1960. Civil rights tactic of blacks sitting in segregated restaurants until being served or removed, kicks. 
Off in Greensboro, North Carolina at Woolworth's lunch counter, each day they came back with more and more protesters until they were finally served. group of civil rights workers who took bus trips through southern states in 1961 to protest illegal bus segregation leaders united farm workers founded 1962 a union formed by cesar chavez and others who gained rights and better treatment for migrant workers Letter from a Birmingham Jail, 1963 A letter written by Martin Luther King Jr. after he had been arrested when he took part in a nonviolent march against segregation, he was disappointed more Christians didn't speak out against racism, advocated nonviolence protest methods. The Feminine Mystique published, 1963 Written by Betty Friedan, journalist and mother of three children, described the problems of middle-class American women and the fact that women were being denied equality with men, said that women were kept from reaching their full human capacities. March on Washington, 1963 August 200,000 demonstrators converged on the Lincoln Memorial to hear Dr. King's speech and to celebrate Kennedy's support for the civil rights movement. John F. Kennedy assassinated November 22, 1963. In Dallas, Texas in a motorcade, Kennedy was fatally shot by Lee Harvey Oswald. Many people questioned this event and believed that Oswald did not act alone or this was a government cover-up. Mississippi Summer Project, 1964 A campaign in the United States launched in June 1964 to attempt to register as many African American voters as possible in Mississippi, which up to the time had almost totally exclude black. Civil Rights Act of 1964 A federal law that authorized federal action against segregation in public accommodations, public facilities and employment the law was passed during a period of great strength for the civil rights movement and President Lyndon Johnson persuaded many reluctant members of Congress to Support the law, a large-scale riot which lasted six days in the Watts neighborhood of Los Angeles, California in August 1965. Though the riots began in August, there had previously been a build-up of racial tension in the area. 
Malcolm X assassinated 1965 Rejecting integration and nonviolence, Malcolm splits off from Elijah Muhammad's black Muslims in is killed by them later upon declaring that blacks should use any means necessary. March from Selma to Montgomery, 1965 a march that was attempted three times to protest voting rights with many peaceful demonstrators. Injured and killed lead by MLK. Voting Rights Act of 1965 A law designed to help end formal and informal barriers to African American suffrage under the law. Hundreds of thousands of African Americans were registered and the number of African American elected officials increased dramatically, encouraged greater social equality and decreased the wealth and education gap. Grape Workers Strike Begins 1965 Farm workers went on strike and made a consumer boycott. They began to be concerned about poison. Again, Chavez goes on 36-day hunger strike, failed to get them to work together. He died in 1993 on a one- to two-day hunger strike. Civil Rights Act of 1968 Provided for equal housing opportunities regardless of race, creed, or national origin and made it a federal crime to, by force or by threat of force, injure, intimidate, or interfere with anyone by reason of their race, color, religion, or national origin. Martin Luther King, Jr. assassinated 1968 Robert F. Kennedy assassinated 1968 The murder of RFK in a Southern California hotel after giving a speech following a victory in CA's presidential primary, he had been a prominent frontrunner in the elections with support and 
sympathy for many hated and discriminated groups who were angry at their treatment, his major belief was that the Vietnam War was unneeded and hurt rather than bolstered the country and that money could be better spent helping the poor and neglected Americans in their own country. Stonewall Riots, 1969. Riots in the New York City neighborhood of Greenwich Village by members of the gay community against a police raid of a gay bar. Title IX, 1972. No person in the United States shall, on the basis of sex, be excluded from participation in, be denied the benefits of, or be subjected to discrimination under any education program or activity, receiving federal financial assistance. Roe v. Wade, 1973 A pregnant woman challenged the Texas state law that she had a constitutional right of her own body and privacy to legally get into abortion, and the Supreme Court agreed an abortion became legal in the first trimester of pregnancy. Jackie Robinson The first African-American player in the Major League of Baseball, his actions helped to bring about other opportunities for African-Americans, broke the color barrier in 1947. Rosa Parks Refused to give up her seat to a white passenger after she was jailed. The Montgomery bus boycott was organized. Rev. Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. Nonviolent leader of the civil rights movement and founder of the Southern Christian Leadership. Conference Elijah Muhammad Leader of the Nation of Islam from 1945 to his death in 1975, he helped many people and was a strong advocate of civil rights but was involved in some shady activities and lost the favor of Malcolm X, who went on to form his own civil rights group. Malcolm X 1952 renamed himself X to signify the loss of his African heritage, converted to Nation of Islam in jail in the 50s, became black Muslims' most dynamic street orator and recruiter. His beliefs were the basis of a lot of the black power movement built on separationist and nationalist impulses to Achieve true independence and equality. James Meredith He was a civil rights advocate who spurred a riot at the University of Mississippi. The riot was Caused by angry whites who did not want Meredith to register at the university, the result was 
forced government action showing that segregation was no longer government policy. George Wallace 1919-1998, four-time governor of Alabama, most famous for his pro-segregation attitude and as a symbol for states' rights. Thurgood Marshall American civil rights lawyer, first black justice on the Supreme Court of the United States. Marshall was a tireless advocate for the rights of minorities and the poor argued the case of Brown v. Board of Education. Betty Friedan 1921-2006 American feminist activist and writer the best known for starting this second wave of feminism through the writing of her book The Feminine Mystique. Cesar Chavez Organized union farm workers help migratory farm workers gain better pay and working conditions. Nonviolent leader of the United Farm Workers from 1963 to 1970, organized laborers in California and in the Southwest to strike against fruit and vegetable growers, unionized Mexican American farm. Jim Crow Laws Southern state laws designed to enforce segregation of blacks from whites. Separate but equal. Principle upheld in Plessy v. Ferguson in which the Supreme Court ruled that segregation of public facilities was legal. The jury segregation. Racial segregation that is required by law. De facto segregation. Segregation resulting from economic or social conditions or personal choice. SCLC Use Christian principles in order to fight segregation nonviolent consisted of black preachers and had a lot of influence churches linked together to inform blacks about changes in the civil rights movement led by MLK advocated passive resistance. Congress of Racial Equality, an organization founded by James Leonard Farmer in 1942 to work for Racial Equality, a U.S. civil rights organization that played a pivotal role in the civil rights movement from its foundation in 1942 to the mid-1960s. Membership is stated to be open to anyone who believes that all people are created equal and is willing to work towards the ultimate goal of true equality throughout the world connected with the Freedom Riders. SNCC A group established in 1960 to promote and use nonviolent means to protest racial discrimination. 
They were the ones primarily responsible for creating the sit-in movement. Sit-in Protests by black college students 1960 to 1961 who took seats at whites only lunch counters in refused to leave until served in 1960 over 50,000 participated in sit-ins across the South there. Success prompted the formation of the Student Nonviolent Coordinating Committee. Nation of Islam A black supremacist group founded in 1930 by Elijah Muhammad, who believed that Allah would create a black nation of people unified against the white man. This group convinced itself that there was no purpose to work with the white man, and it is important to build the black people up and become economically self-sufficient, but exemplifying the importance of not interacting with white people whenever possible and becoming a believer in black nationalism. Black Panthers A black political organization that was against peaceful protest and for violence if needed. The organization marked a shift in policy of the black movement, favoring militant ideals rather than peaceful protests. Led by Bobby Seale and Huey Newton, they believed that racism was an inherent part of the U.S. capitalist society and were militant, self styled revolutionaries for black power. Black Power A slogan used to reflect solidarity and racial consciousness used by Malcolm X, it meant that equality could not be given but had to be seized by a powerful, organized black community idea. Phrased by Stokely Carmichael, the belief that blacks should fight back if attacked, it urged blacks to achieve economic independence by starting and supporting their own business. Busing in the context of civil rights, the transportation of public school students from areas where they live to schools and other areas to eliminate school segregation based on residential patterns. Affirmative Action a policy in educational admissions or job hiring that gives special attention or compensatory treatment to traditionally disadvantaged groups in an effort to overcome present effects of past discrimination, improving economic and educational opportunities for women, blacks and other Now, National Organization of Women, 1966, Betty Friedan, first president, wanted equal employment. Opportunity Commission enforce its legal mandate to end sex discrimination. IRA Equal Rights Advocates is a non-profit women's rights organization that was founded in 1974. IRA is a legal organization dedicated to protecting and expanding economic and educational access and 
Opportunities for Women and Girls, the organization specializes in advocating for the rights of women. In minimum wage jobs, women of color and immigrant women era is based in San Francisco and led by Executive Director Noreen Farrell. The pill gave women greater freedom to be sexually active without the risk of pregnancy birth control method that weakened the link between sex and marriage Chicano Name given to Mexican Americans who in 1970 were the majority of migrant farm labor in the U.S. AIM American Indian movement demanded greater rights for Native Americans and preservation of their Traditions used violence to make its point called for a renewal of traditional cultures, economic independence, and better education. American Indian movement occupied Woodidney to bring attention to the government's mistreatment of Native Americans including their living conditions in the trail of broken treaties as demonstrators in Washington, D.C. put it. National Interstate and Defense Highways Act The largest public works project in American history when it was passed authorized $25 billion to build 41,000 miles of roads, greatly assisting the burgeoning car culture of the 1950s. Executive Order 10730, Desegregation of Central High School The President issued Executive Order 10730, sending in federal troops to maintain order and enforce the integration of the school later extended to other American schools. President Dwight D. Eisenhower's Farewell Address Warned Against a Military-Industrial Complex